No, espere, Ay, esa no. No. No, porque fíjate que no está bien enfocado. No, no. Coño, coño, que me está grabando. ¡Ya! <risa> Por eso, Jen, I'm here in the Netherlands. I am the new director of ISEC International for SA Jen. I uh, have been here for around one month, but I'm not alone. I have some friends that I want to introduce you, which is the Jen board. So, Asier, can you introduce yourself? Antonio! <laughs> 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 Hola, this is Yen. Uh, my name is Asir Ansorena. I'm the new project manager for business entrepreneurship and corporate social responsibility. I'm 24 years old. I'm from Spain, from the northern region in the Basque Country near France. Ah, sola. No me estoy mirando. Estoy mirando. Estoy haciendo la prueba. Hola, soy Jen. I am Alejandra Lighton. I'm 25 years old. I'm from Colombia, and I'm the new project manager for social entrepreneurship for the SGN board. Hello, SGN, and welcome to the SGN in Spain MC's office. My name is Tony Miret, and I'm currently MCP of ISEC in Spain. I'm 24 years old, and I was born in Barcelona, a city in the northeast of Spain. Una pesada. Una princesita. Hey, this is Jen. My name is Cindy. I'm 22 years old, Mexican, and I am the new non-corporate relations manager for 0708. Bueno, este, hemos estado trabajando aproximadamente un mes y estamos muy felices con las cosas que hemos encontrado y lo que viene, lo que viene en este año. <laughs> Hola Pura Vida, my name is Juan, I'm 28 years old, I'm from Costa Rica and I'm the new ISEC International Director for SSGN. I joined ISEC in October 2003 uh, as an SM, in that moment we have SMs. I went to Romania for one year and a half and did a traineeship in a factory that was manufacturing uh, furniture for offices. When, after the traineeship finished, I went back to Costa Rica and I was in the first MC of Central America South as VP Talent Management. And last year I was working in mainland of China as VP Projects. I started ISEC uh, in the US in 2003. Um, I joined my second year university. I started um, as an OGX member. I was looking for organizations that did that and on campus at the University of Michigan and I found ISEC through a friend of mine. In 2007, I went to uh, Jordan to join the MC. Um, originally, I started as a seed for two months, and then you know the MC liked my work, and, and I started as an, as an MC member of, uh, of Jordan. It was an expansion country, so we were the first uh, MC, which was a really exciting opportunity to be able to work, um, you know, to, to start up a country, to start, uh, start Isaac in a country, in a region like uh, the Middle East. is an incredible experience. I joined in Isaac in 2002, when I was studying social communication and journalism in Bogota. And after almost one year, I became LCP of my of my LC, which is uh, I say Javeriana. 2006, I decided to have my international experience, and I did my internship in Brazil, in, in Porto Alegre. I was working for an NGO supporting communication projects uh, for uh, a Checo fellow, and for me, it was an incredible experience because I know a little bit more about the, the Brazilian culture and the reality of all that stuff. And in 2006, I. I went back to Colombia and I decided to apply for MC. The last year I was in TVP People Development of Colombia and I had the chance to work with uh, the entire people from ICA in Colombia and I traveled to, to Poland and I did a, a lot of amazing things and that's it. I first joined ISEC in October 2003 in Barcelona in Bella Terras LC. There I was new member for one year. Afterwards I was working one year in the ICX area after that, I was another year uh, LCP of, uh, of Bella Terras LC. Uh, I ran for MCVP. I got it. And I was last year here in the MC's office working as uh, finance and ER for ISEC in Spain. And finally, I applied 
for MCP again and I got it. So this year I am MCP and now I've been two months working here with my with all my team and with Cindy from SSGN board and I'm really happy about that. I just studied in the National Affairs and I joined IS2 in 2003. After six, seven months I became the LC coordinator and then LCP of my LC. That is named Culiacán. Then I applied for the Mexican MC for external relations team and I was part of the MC 0607. And then I decided to apply for the SSGM board for this position that is PR on the non corporate activities. To have real results, that we, we all act as one entity. All the MCPs, all the MCVPs, all the members of the GN are working together and going for one objective, which is making SSGN the biggest GN in the world. I don't want people in general to talk about SSGN as a region with a lot of potential or talk about CERMAS uh, in terms of potential. I want, I want them to talk in June 2008 about all the achievements we've made, all the results, turn the, that potential into actual results and, and Isaac experiences, issue-based experiences. So yeah, that's my goal for, for the year. So we want to have more Kellogg's, more Artemisia, and more projects involving more members to actually be able to provide this IS experience that are going to make us be the leaders for Latin America that our society is needed. My, mes my message for you is that, that enjoy and take the opportunities that we have in the, into the SGN. Uh, not only in the social entrepreneurship uh, corner, we have an um, incredible experiences from the CR, from the business entrepreneurship, and you have the incredible chance to take advantage of, of our platform. So I really would like that more people have uh, decided to apply, decided to go and exchange, decided to create more people, to, decided to, to open opportunities for, for people from Latin America and the other countries from our network. I'm really happy to be the new ISEC International Director for SIGM, uh, mostly because I believe in Latin America and I believe in the connection that Latin America has with countries like the US, Spain and Portugal. I believe that we, we can be more than we are right now. I think that young people in Latin America not, not only has the will to do things, but they also have the capacity. And I believe that the things that we can bring to, to all of us are the tools and the network that to, to drive the social change that our countries need. And I think that during this term, if we focus on CERMAS and if we focus on delivering complete ISEC experiences, we will be able to make a difference and to be more.